Hey there guys, I will be doing a video of how to use FOTMOB. It's really easy. Um, let me give you a little idea of what it does. It's a bit of an advertisement to be honest. Um, it's not really an advertisement, but you know what I mean. Um, basically, in this part here, you put down your favourite teams, and my favourite teams are AC Milan, Bournemouth, Atletico Madrid, Barcelona, Bayern Munich, Boca Juniors, Everton, Juventus, Man City, Man United, Paris Saint Germain, Real Madrid, Roma, Napoli, and Tranmere Rovers. And here, it tells me all the games that are going on today. And this is the fav. This is my favourites. Um, Liverpool are playing Everton today uh, at half past one. Um, Roma are playing Palermo at 2 o'clock. Manchester United are playing Arsenal. That's Manchester United, my best team ever. Um, playing them at 4 o'clock. Um, Bayern Munich play Borussia Dortmund. That's a big game. At half past 4. Juventus play Bologna at, um, at um, 5 o'clock. Fesco Madrid versus Real Madrid at half past 7. Um... AC Milan play um, Napoli at 7.45. Paris Saint-Germain play Marseille. And Boca Juniors play Cruel de Norte. And in, in the Premier League tonight, Everton play Liverpool. Manchester United play Arsenal. Swansea play Tottenham. Charlton Athletic play Fulham. Monaco play Venice. Um, Cairn Saint-Germain play Parseille. Bayern Munich play Borussia Dortmund. Bayer Leverkusen play Augsburg. Oh, I remember um, once on Bayer Leverkusen versus Augsburg. Oh, it, it was quite a while ago, but Augsburg's goalkeeper scored um, against Bayer Leverkusen last time of the time before they played. Yeah, so that's good. Um, and I think I'm going to add a team... To um, no, I'm not. I'm not in Premier. And um, I'm gonna search um. Oh, I'll do. Um, I'm gonna look for Borussia. And see what we get. By Munich versus Borussia Dortmund. Or it's saying um, the team that it's it that it's telling me about the team. The next match is by Munich. Last five games: Drew, 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 one and one. Seventeen points, five wins, two draws, and zero losses. On Bayang, top goal scorer, Matthew Ginter, top assists, and. Mitarayan, most yellow cards, which is one. News? Yeah, background music. Um, Robert Lewandowski, looking forward to Bayern Munich bout with former side Borussia Dortmund. List of Ballon d'Or 2015 candidates reportedly leaked. Should we have a look at that then? Um, Spanish football outlet Mundo Vosso claims to have got their hands on leak of list contenders for this year's Ballon d'Or containing 59 names which will later be whittled down to 23 before a winner is announced. Um, a player from Swindon Town is actually um, on the list as well. Um, players from Juventus, Chileni, Paul Pogba, Morato, New York City, Andre Perlo, Boca Juniors, Carlos Tevez, Bayern Munich, Arturo Vidal, Robert Lewandowski, Adrian Robben, David Alaba, Thomas Muller and Manuel Naya. Man City, Wilfred Boney, Yaya Turi, Sergio Aguero, Nicolas Otamendi, Kim De Bruyne. Chelsea, Jim, the Bauta Courtois, Ian Hazard, um, in Paris Saint-Germain, Ezra Ibrahimovic and Pastore. United, 
Wayne Rooney, David De Gea and Memphis Depay, Arsenal, David Ospina and Alexis Sanchez, Let's Go Madrid, Antoine Griezmann, Jackson Martinez, Tottenham, I'm not going to go through the ball, but just, that just gives you a, um, idea, so, we're just going to watch this video, then we're going to wrap it up. My love, come on, come on, let's go, lose. The Ballon d'Or is the most prestigious award a footballer can receive. For these seven legends, though, the gong always evaded them. Often considered Real Madrid's greatest player ever, Raúl is Los Blancos' all-time scorer and a true international legend. Maldini amassed 26 honours in his 25 years of service to the Rossoneri, making him one of the most successful players ever in the history of the sport. It wasn't just the goal scoring for Thierry Henry, it was the way he did it. The grace and poise became Henry's trademark as he terrified defences all over the world. The cultured midfielder has been the cog in the two most effective footballing machines of the 21st century, Barcelona and Spain. Xavi won every trophy there is to be won, plus being the captain for both of his sides. The dead ball specialist was always an integral part of any team he played for and was normally the most reliable player on the field with his immense passing skill and reading of the game. Ryan Giggs never really had one season where he stood out above the rest. He had around 15 where he consistently performed in the red of Manchester United. Maybe that was his problem. No list would be complete without the man himself who has won a domestic title at every club he's played for. There was only one Slater. Ah, okay, so we're going to wrap up the video now. See you guys.